I am very glad to have you all here, my honorable council members. The constitution of the land stipulates that after seven days, the princess must be presented to the community. You have done really well, my queen. I don't think there's more to discuss. We should allow the community. You are right, Chief Ekele. But let me quickly remind this council that the princess is incomplete. Absolutely. Chief Fukano. Yes. Are you trying to tell this council that the princess is deformed? No. But we all know that after 19 days of our presentation to the community, in which she will perform all traditional rites, we will all crown her. But the constitution forbids any prince or princess to be crowned without a wife or a husband. I see. So what you are saying is that um, she should not be crowned. I have not said that. The constitution did. She must have a husband before her full coronation as the queen. Well, not to worry. It will be taken care of. Um, why not we leave? Are you waiting for anyone, Jay? Yes. Uh, let me see how the Queen will jump the fence now. <laughs> Chief Patrick. to where her food is served. Yeah. Don't fail me when you have the opportunity to garnish her food with this. Yeah. <laughs> Sir. I hope this is not meant to kill her. To what I told you. Don't you let me down. I have the power to put your life in jail for a long time. Go now. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thank you. 
Oh my God. This place is wonderful. Muna. Mm hmm? This is where you now live. Mm hmm. I am the princess in this beautiful house. Isn't that glorious? Very well. My dear, you are both blessed. Yeah, I know. Just come. Let me go and change it to my royal regalia and I can show you my chambers and every other place. In Greetings to the morning star, the princess of the great Obima kingdom. Oh, God has blessed the day I set my eyes on you. Forgive the interruption, my princess. My name is Ken, the newly employed guard. Oh, okay. Thanks for your praises, Ken. Come Don't leave the princess. The jewel, the only eye of the great Obima Palace. Your kingdom will never end. Yes, you will prosper, my princess. Thank you once again, Mr. Ken. Come on, Peggy. Let's go. Let me warn you. Go back to your duty post at once. Yes, sir. serious. It will be difficult for us to get her a husband within 22 days. Greetings, my queen. The princess is back from school. Good. I'd like to speak to her at once. She'll be with you in a moment. Sorry, this is Muna. You mean this is your bedroom? <laughs> Thank you. Isn't it sweet? Look, if you go to the wardrobe, you will see my fine clothes and shoes grandma bought for me. Can't check it. Wow. What a word. And you'll be suffering all this when you get to the wardrobe. Just go and check them first now. Yes, dear. I so much like that 
Me too. I love her too much. As in, I'm so so lucky to be employed for her. Not be by my power. Now how girls doing? <laughs> yes. Yes, babe. That guy has romantic vibes. As in, did you see how he was praising the princess? Oh my god, he's so cute. He was just all over her. My dear, you see why it's good to be a princess? <laughs> oh my god. Yes, so, please, you can't get the princess for you. She will soon be through with her French. Oh, yes. Hello, did you see Bella? No, I thought she's in the kitchen. No, where could she be? I have forgotten that we need to prepare the queen's food. I have no Good day, Grandma. Good day, darling. Good day, dear. How are you doing? I'm fine. <laughs> My angels. How was school today? Splendid. <laughs> Imagine my first day as another person, as a very powerful individual. Oh. <laughs> I can feel that right here. <laughs> mm. Well, that is why I sent for you. I want us to talk. Okay. What is it? John, thank you, Hilary. My granny. My dear angel. See, there's a traditional constitution which states that the princess or the prince must be presented to the council and seven days after they'll be presented to the community and thereafter after 15 days the princess or the prince will be crowned as king or queen of the kingdom. <laughs> I don't see a problem with that. You've presented me to the council already. Yes, you're, you're very right. Yes, you're right. But mm, there's a snag there. You're not married. If you're not married, you can't get the show. Um, you need to be married. You must be married. Grandma! Marriage? You know I'm still too young to talk about that. I know. I know. But that's what the traditional constitution states. If you're not able to get married, then you'll be discarded. You'll lose the crown and Another will be crowned the king of the kingdom, and I guess that will be it for us. We're doomed. What do we do? What? And I don't have any man in my life. The only one I had, the only friend that I cared and loved. He betrayed me, Robin. I don't even want to have anything to do with him again. I do agree with you on that. He's off. I can't even imagine him being my son-in-law. But then, what else can we do? What do you think we can do? An angel. So, Uncle, tell me, 
What is your plan this time? What are you up to? This time, it's for real. Whatever plan I have now will work. Your friend Ken is in there for me. He's our eye in the palace. Yeah, Ken told me that you asked him to go to the palace to get a job. Yes. Now he has been employed, so what's the next thing? I am asking you so that I know how to play my own game. I am not happy with you the last time. You messed me up. It's okay. That was then. I had to have someone in there to tell me what goes on in the palace. Eh? Son, you have to start looking for a wife. Wife? Yes. Yes. Come in. Hey, Bella, come here. <laughs> Good evening, Chief. Good evening. Good evening, Prince Williams. Yo, what a good time for you to come. Please sit down. Thank you, sir. <laughs> um, I came to see you. Yes, you did well. That's exactly what I was here talking with my son. Let's plan this together. Don't tell me what you're feeling or what you're not feeling. What we are about to do is for your own good. Uh, it's been said that the princess will be presenting her husband to us. You know she will get married. Uh, but information reaching me is that the guy she loves is in prison. Yes. After her kidnapping saga, mm -hmm. the guy was arrested and she felt betrayed. For now, the guy is no longer in the picture. She doesn't have any Wow. Oh. Are you serious? <laughs> so what you are trying to say is she will be removed. She will no longer be the queen. <laughs> <laughs> this is good. Now you see why I told you to start preparing. Yeah. Ken is in there to give me lead. All right? If they decide to choose any guy, I'll make sure he doesn't live to marry the princess. <laughs> you know, um, Uncle, now I know your plans. So I'll know how to venture into it. Yes. I know one thing for sure that um, it will be easy for me to get a wife and the other way. Absolutely. <laughs> and now that Bella is here, <laughs> both of you can start to get to know each other so that she can become your wife as soon as possible. <laughs> Thank you, Chief. You're welcome, dear. Eh, Mona, you not eat with fork and knife. Hmm. That's me. That's what I've been learning since so imagine me. Eating with fork and knife. Please, I can't eat with that. But I drop it and use your spoon. Oh. Oh. Maris and Akese, why are you both standing like that? Come on, we are friends now. You can join me. You know I don't like it when you stand like that. Thank you, my princess. You are just a good friend. I've not seen your type before. Thank you, my princess. Hmm, Peggy. My angel. Peggy is here. Oh, Peggy. How are you doing? I'm glad to see that you're doing very well. Sit down, sit down, sit down. I didn't know you were eating already. Come on, come on, join us. I'm fine. I'm fine. So, Peggy, how are you doing now? You're feeling well now. Yes, my queen. I came to thank you for all you've done for me. If not for you, I'd have been dead by now. It's okay. Sorry. It's okay. We thank God for everything. Thank God. Mm. And you too. The next time I see you seated, 
while the princess is eating. You will be fine. Do I make myself clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. Sir. Enjoy your meal. Bella, Bella, what is all this now? Why are you disturbing us? Why did you not allow us to sleep? Are you the only one lying down here? Big mouth, she's not the only one. How do you expect us to sleep with this call you've been making? And besides, when did you start making such romantic calls? Look at who is talking. Because I'm lying down here with two girls, that's why you have the mouth to talk to me anyhow. Eh? When did you join the palace meeting? When did you come into this palace that you're talking to me anyhow? Huh? Well, what is the meaning of all this? Do you want me to report it to the Queen? Does it look as if I'm scared of the Queen? Really? Yes! So let me tell you what, very soon you'll be bowing down to me, throwing flowers for me to work on. Huh? For you? Yes, because I'm wearing the same uniform with you guys. You think you can talk to me anyhow? Don't worry, I'll report to you. Please call me back, okay? <laughs> Where is Ken the new guy? Oh. Oh. Ken, I I don't know, but I think he should be in this room. Doing what? He was the one I asked to wash this car that the Queen will be using it this morning. I didn't see him. That's why I had to wash the car myself. But I, I think he should be in this room. Okay, and EK um are dressing up, so I need to wash the car before they come out. It's okay. Go back to work. Okay. He has to be doing something. I will not tolerate this laziness in this palace. My Queen, you have a meeting with the Prime Minister of Ubo Kingdom by 2.30 p.m. Also, you have a road inspection to the stream by 3 p.m. Oh. All these in one day. That's fine. But first, we'll go to the Princess's school. We need to get her into a new school. 
And I think that if we get her into a mixed school, that could increase her chances of making friends and if possibly get a husband. My queen, I doubt that a change of school will get the princess a husband within the time frame we have. So what do you think I should do then? I mean, already she's complained about not liking the school, so she still needs a change of school. Let's start from there first. Yes, my queen. <laughs> hmm? Come in. Yes, good morning, my beautiful princess and her lovely friend. Thank you, Kay. Thanks, girl. You brought our uniform. Oh, oh yes, um, I, I, I earned it for the both of you. Mm. Oh, thank you so much. Um, Ken, yes. do you have any particular duty assigned to you in this palace? No, my sweet princess, I'm walking all over. Mm. Ah, well, my princess, I have to leave the both of you now to, to prepare for school. It's already time. Mm. Your room is splendor. All right, then. Thanks. Take my leave. What? You have to make him a personal guide, at least for me to be. Peggy! Mm -hmm. You're so spoiled. What is happening? God, I'm sure I kept the uniform here. Who, who took it now? I can't want to be this one now. Alice. Yes? Did you see Ken the new guard? No. Actually, I'm looking for the princess's uniform. I kept it here only for me to go inside and get her socks. I can't find the uniform now. I don't even know who has it. I'm looking for that guy. I asked him to wash one of the queen's cars. He didn't do it. I searched for him in his room. He's not there. Where could he be? Me, I don't know. I'm also looking for the princess's uniform. Ah. Here you go. Go check if one of the maids has taken it to her. Maids, ah. okay. You see, she's not really my kind of girl. But I'm just playing along because of the throne. It's okay. Very soon, things will start turning around for you. <sighs> I pray. I will see your friend Ken today to see, to know how far he has gone with his plans. Okay. I hope this will work out. I don't want this to fail this time. I am praying seriously for this. Williams, calm down. The throne is ours. Eh? If the queen and the princess escapes this plan this time, then I'll know she's a witch. Get out, my boy. Okay. I believe you.
so delighted to have you in my office, Mona. Point of correction, Princess Mona. Oh, so sorry, Princess Mona. You're welcome, my queen. Thank you very much. You see, my granddaughter, the heiress to Obimo Kingdom, has told me quite a lot about your school. And um, I'm here to make a change of school for her. Please, my queen, don't do this. Please. We never knew she is a princess. Please, princess, forgive us, please. I'm sorry. I've been taking rubbish from students in this school. Even when they get in my way, you blame me for it. Grandma, I don't think a princess can stay here. My princess, I am sorry. Please, I know you're a good girl. You don't have a bad heart. See, I promise from now on, I will make it up to you. You being in this school alone is a plus for us now. Please, forgive us, please. Hmm? When people know that you're here, it takes the school to greater heights. My princess, please. Grandma, it's okay. Let me just stay here, since I'm my friend. <sighs> Thank, Thank you. Well, Madam Principal. My queen. I will no longer tolerate any hostility towards my granddaughter, Princess Muna, the heiress to Obimo Kingdom, from you, your students, or any other person. Do I make myself clear? Yes, yes, my queen. You will not even hear anything again, I promise you. And from now on, you know she's a princess, and she should be treated as such. Yes, my queen. I promise. Thank you, my princess. My princess. I'm going somewhere. Oh, my princess, I'm not a driver. I understand. But I just want you to take me there. I will enjoy it more if you do. Okay, my princess. Honestly, I'm speechless. I don't even know what to do. Wait, what's your grandma saying about this whole Nothing. thing? Nothing. What can she say? She doesn't know what to do. This is, it's, it's very, very difficult. If I'm a man, I can easily walk out and pick a wife for myself. But now I'm a young girl. Where do I start from? <sighs> don't worry, it's okay, huh? We we'll definitely figure a way out of this. I think the queen can use her power to abolish the tradition. Yes, it's possible. Listen, if we don't do something fast, a lot of things will go wrong. You have 17 days left. Two days to your presentation to the community and 50 days to your coloration. Calm down, calm down, calm down. But let me ask, is that why you left the palace without your maids? The queen might be angry if she finds out. Don't do that again. I don't need them. My dad is enough for me. Besides, I need solution and not flour. My baby, calm down. Oh, oh, beware. Now, you. you have to start going. 
Okay, these are my friends and relatives that are looking for a wife. No, they're all too old for her. She's a young girl. My queen, we don't have time. We have barely 17 days. The princess might lose out on this. Never. I don't know what to do. I know we're in a critical period. But I know I have to do something. Jan. My queen. What do we do? I mean, it seems like Chief Patrick has bought over all the elders. My queen, why don't you present this man to the princess? She might like any one of them. No. They're too old. She's a young girl. She needs a young man. So what do we do, my queen? Resignation letter. What? Why? Do you have a problem? No problem. I think I found myself a better job. Okay. That's fine. But at least you would have given us some time to get your replacement. I don't even have time for myself. Please help me talk to the queen about it. with her. A resignation. Anyway, I wish her luck. What could possibly make her leave? I don't know my queen. I guess she she wasn't happy. Where's my granddaughter? Where's my granddaughter? My queen, she's not in the palace. She went out only when the guard came. What? Are you both telling me that she left this palace all by herself? With just the guard? Yes, my queen. That was her command. She didn't want us to go with her. How could she do a thing like that? Did she go with Peggy? No. Only with the guard. I think they were going to see her mother. And let me once she's back. Well done. You have done very well. Williams, both of you need to start making arrangements. Okay? I told you they will fail this time. Yes, they have failed. You have succeeded, Chief. There is no way they will get another man to marry her before the deadline. No way. That's impossible. No, I am so happy. This is a massive I cannot be to have this thing on my head. I told you. I told you, Ken will succeed in his own plans. He's already succeeding. He's not very close to the princess. Yes. <laughs> I trust him. I trust that boy. I know why I gave him that job. Now the queen will start to see that her stubbornness will come to nothing. Williams. 
Where is your wife? You two need to start getting along and prepare for the throne. Um, Bella. Sir. You can stay the night. Thank you, sir. <laughs> stay the night. I mean, you can pass the night. Yes. <laughs> I'm so happy. Everything eventually is working out for my good. Yeah. But you see, I am not surprised because I knew it would work out. You know, my uncle is somebody that when he sets out to do something, he must always achieve it. I hate that queen. She's selfish. She's so full of herself. I agree with you. But you see, do not worry about the queen. Very soon, she will step down. We will take over the chambers. Trust me. I trust you. That's it. Baby. Try faster. So that we'll go home. <laughs> Why are you so much in a hurry? If we get home now, what will happen? Then we just pray. Yeah, pray to God to help us get to the front faster. We just pray. Yes. <laughs> Let's go and pray. Okay. <laughs> Bad guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. My princess, whatever it is that troubles you, you sure do know it has an expiry date. I don't want you to cry. I want you to cheer up. Please. Karen. I don't know what to do. I'm confused. If I lose out, it will break my grandmother. What could that be? No. My princess, I know I am a nobody. I know I'm just an ordinary guard in the palace. But my advice can go a long way to help you. You deserve everything good in life. You don't deserve to cry. Not tears. I understand. It's just that... I cannot share it with you. Not because you're a palace guard, but for security's sake. I hope you understand. Yeah. Listen, Ken. Take me to a pub. I want to drink. A pub? I don't get it, but I thought you said we're going to your friend's, your friend's place, Peggy. Why a pub? Just do as I've said. Take me there. I want to ease the troubles in my heart. Just, just drive. Okay, okay. okay. You sure you don't want me to sing for you? Go on. Yes, my princess. Let's go 
assistir aqui. De novo, longa aí, cara. Okay, my princess. I must tell you, this is not the right thing for you. Don't you think people might recognize you? Okay. Tell me. What's the essence of becoming the crown princess? Without a man by your side. Okay. Mm. <coughs> I am Ken. From Umakama village. I'm an orphan. I came back to the village after I lost my parents in a costly motor accident in Lagos State. That is where I was born and brought up. She's drunk. Yes, um, I tried to stop her, but you know, please, the queen must not hear about this. Please. There is no point in begging me. She knows already. How could you have allowed her to get drunk? I tried. I tried everything possible. She wouldn't listen. What would I have done? You didn't try it all. What's wrong? What happened to my granddaughter? Huh? My what queen. happened to her? My queen, I'm sorry. Okay, what happened? My queen, I'm sorry. My queen, I tried to stop her, but she wouldn't listen. My queen, she took a, a whole bottle of red wine alone. My God. Oh, why would princess do such a thing to herself? But why did you not call me? I mean, I don't have your number. Yes, she has, but she, she, she didn't allow me to, to call you. Oh. All right, just, just leave. Leave, go, 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 go. Mavis, you stay with her, take care of her. 
alert me once she's awake, right? Okay, my friend. Oh. like this since then? Yes, my queen. I've been sleeping soundly. Can't say that she needed to twin for her to sleep. My queen, as you can see, there is nothing to worry about. She'll be fine in the morning. Well, I don't have to stay with her then. Why would the princess do such a thing to herself? Why would she put herself through this mess? Someone that is about to be presented to the community next tomorrow. Oh. Well, I'll just have to stay here till morning. My queen, doesn't mean you will sleep in her room. She might only wake up in the morning. My queen, Maris are going to be for us to see if she can eat. Well, just to do just that, do just that. Hmm? Okay. Um, I'll come and see her in the morning. Right? Okay. okay. She's still having hangovers. Yeah. She actually like this. Uh, okay. Um, one piece and uh, one case. I think you, you have to go get her a, a bottle of cold water. Yeah. Or get her a bottle of wine. Yeah, she'll be fine. Wine? Yes. The one she took, she has not recovered from it. Now you want to give her another one. Please count me out. But that is how to cure hangovers fast. Yes, she will be fine. Okay. Yes, please. Let's give it a try. Go. Go ahead. Go ahead. Then yeah, you can go with her. No problem. Good morning, my future king. Can you imagine what I saw on Facebook? This what? Here. Ken, kissing the princess at the bar. Are you sure this is true? Why, why, why would he do a thing like this? This is confusing. Oh, is it possible that Ken has fallen in love with the princess? No. He dare not do that. But on the other hand, it is to our own advantage. Why? How? For a princess to kiss a man in a public place is a big minus for her to attend the throne of Obimo Kingdom. Yes, she is going to be disqualified from sitting on that throne. Based on that. So, what do we do now? <laughs> what else do we do? We have to wait for time. The ball is in our court. <laughs> time, time, my son. <laughs> ah. My queen, 
I, I found it difficult to show you this. Now I have to. What is it? What? Yes, it's a princess. What's this? How did you come about this? I saw it on Facebook, my queen. Face. What do we do? What can we do? This is not fair, yeah? How, how can I do it? For what? Yeah? So Even this is what you came to this palace to do? You? Yeah. Me? Am I mad? Yeah? Even you can't even understand with me. I didn't do it. I did not. Mark! Yes, boss. Take him out of this palace at once! Yeah, wait, he's... Wait, please. Please, I beg you. Yeah? I did not do it. I, I, I'm telling you... Hey, you Ken! Hey! You know what you have to do now? Undress yourself before you leave this place. Because you are not taking anything that is of royalty out of this palace. Be fast! No. Okay. Hey! Be fast. Because hey! Be fast about it. Can't you understand with me? Eh? Understand with me now. Don't let me lose my temper. Fast. Everything. Let me, Everything. Understand with me now. Eh? Whatever you did bring into this palace, you are not taking it out of this palace. Fast. The shoes. We bought him this shoe. Including the stories. See, uh, bros. Be fast about this thing. He, he's not. He's the one removing it now. Uh, but I can't do this kind of thing. You know now. I can't do it. Eh? Take off his shoes. It, you see, the thing is, is refusing to come out. <laughs> Take off his shoes. Even the shoes too. Fast. The watch is... Is what? Hmm? Is what? Nothing. Nothing. Sorry, sir. This one. Out. Okay. me when I asked him to take me to the bar. Nice. I hate men like that. Why would he take you there? Because I forced him to. 
asked him. I commanded him. Do you expect him to disobey me? So, you forced him to kiss you? Did you also force him to kiss you? Did you... Do you know what you've done? You've just thrown away the throne. And there's nothing else I can do. That's it. Grandma, no. No, Grandma. Grandma, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. But you know it's my right. Oh, yeah? It's your right, right? It's your right to show to the whole community that their future queen is an irresponsible young girl. At a young age. You have failed yourself. You have failed me. And I'm not happy with you. I'm so, so disappointed. Grandma. And what happened? That I was disgraced and stripped out of the palace. Innocently, wrongly accused. Wrongly? I saw it in the news. <laughs> but it's okay. Because she will be disqualified from being the queen. Disqualified? Why? But sir, I didn't kiss her. Yes, she, yes, she was drunk. She wanted to throw herself at me, but I refused. People were taking pictures and that's, that's how he came online. Ken, okay. it's okay. You did very well. As long as you did poison her food, she will soon die. Sir, so I, I... I didn't. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm sorry I lied to you. I, I, I could... Sir, so she was just a good girl. She was just a good girl. She was so nice to me that I couldn't find myself to do it. It's okay. It's okay. Let me go inside and get something. Then we'll stroll down. I'll show you the land I promised you. Okay? Yeah. Okay, sir. Sir, she's a very responsible girl. You don't have to kill yourself. No. What have I done? What did I do? And now Ken. Ken is in trouble. I know. But who will believe you? The Queen is angry. I saw this online. I had to come. Just tell me, Peggy. What do you want me to do? And now this will affect me from becoming the queen of this land. Mom, this... It's okay. It's okay. You will explain to the council. They will understand. Hmm? Calm yourself. You need to shower, then eat. Bye. 
Listen, my princess, I trust in you. I believe in you. And I am very proud of you. You are not irresponsible. Even if they don't want you to become the queen anymore, it's fine. No problem. Mommy, I feel for Ken. Ken is innocent. And grandma doesn't want to believe it. Because no caring mom would want to believe that so easily. So calm down. The truth can be hidden for long. If you're destined to be their queen, you will. And you shouldn't get it. Ken is innocent. I caused all this. Oh. He's innocent. He's a gentleman. He's nice. He's fun to be with. Do you know that he sings for me? For me. Please. Ken is in trouble. Please just help me. It's okay. I promise. I am going to speak to the queen about it myself. Okay? Calm down. Don't let it bother you anymore. Thank you, Mom. But. At your palace. I want to go there again. I don't want to be a queen again. No they way. They should just eat it. No way. You are going back tomorrow morning. Remember, you will still be presented to the community. So, you'll go back. Hmm? I will speak to the queen myself. Smile for me. Smile. Smile for me. My baby. <laughs> it's okay. Uncle, where is Ken? I searched everywhere for him. I went to the palace. I, I was told that the queen sent him out. What is going on? Where can he be? I don't know. He might have gone out. I don't think so. There is no way Ken can make such a decision without telling me. We are all he has got. Eh? And I don't think that Ken will kiss the princess. I, there is something that is not right. Something is going on. Then you don't know your friend. He has failed you. He has failed us. And how did you know? Have you heard from him? Huh? Or did he tell you with his mouth? Because I remember you saying something about writing, writing him off. Uncle? I hope it's not what I am thinking. Eh? Because Ken is my very good friend. Where is Ken? If anything happens to Ken, I will not take it from you. I don't have anything to do with his whereabouts. He is guilty. That is why he has been running away from you. Eh? I need some sleep. Alright, Uncle. Um, I've heard what you've said. Uncle, just hold on one minute. So that won't be in the same track. I will search for him again tomorrow. But Uncle, if I can't find him, I will go against you. Yes. Ken is a very good friend of mine, and I find him with friendship more than the truth. How can I catch some sleep after what you just said? Hey, Williams. I'd like to move a motion for the amendment, the constitutional amendment, in the case of my granddaughter, Princess Muna, getting a husband before she can be installed as the queen of the land. My queen, just tell us that 
she has not found a man than bringing that story of constitutional amendment. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I'm sure you all are a witness to the fact that it's a lot easier for a man to find a wife than the other way around. And moreover, my granddaughter is still quite young. My queen, do you realize that the princess ought to be installed within 15 days from now and 29 days have passed? How do you think you can affect the constitutional amendment before that time? Now, let me quickly remind us that there is an irresponsible saga that is in the air which concerns our dear princess and her flirtatious movement towards the certain guard. My God! And then Ken. Huh. I don't know if you want to talk about it or if you're ready to talk about it. Where's my grandma? She's in the meeting with the castle of Edels. What is the matter? I have to see her. I must see her. I know they are deciding my fate. But it's time I let them know what I really feel. My princess, don't you think it would be unwise for you to be the queen? I don't care. Maris, wait for me in the room. Yes. This is a shameful act. Are we still going on with making an irresponsible girl our future queen? No way. I disagree. I am not irresponsible, sir. Mona, why don't you wait for me in your chambers? No, Grandma. It's time I stand up and speak for myself. I'm a true born of this kingdom. So tell me, what's the crime that a young girl committed to have played with her husband to be? Husband to be? Abomination. Yes. I want to marry Ken. Eh? Marry him? I love him. Grandma. I really want to marry Ken. I love him a lot. Angel. Yes. Greetings to you all. Well, it is your house. Yes, um, what do you have for us, Mr. Williams? Your Highness, I'm here to say to Your Highness, I'm here to say to Scott with this man, Mr. Patrick. Are you okay? I'm fine. Not have you come here to ask me where I am. I said, I am not going anywhere. Listen, I have searched everywhere for Ken. I can't find him. And remember, you said something about killing him. Have you killed him so that I can settle this right here and now? I am asking you, where is Ken? Is this young man okay? My elders, let me apologize on his behalf. Let's go see us. Uh, uh, my elders, with all due respect, um, Your Highness, I am no longer interested in the throne. I do not want the throne anymore. The throne belongs to Muna, so I am, I am, I am, I am quitting. I, I don't want anything to raise for the throne. I, I don't want anything to do with the throne. All I want right now is for Mr. Patrick to tell me where is Ken. Does he know Ken? This is how you want it, um, Your Highness. Yes, Mr. Patrick here sent Ken to this palace. To kill the princess. What? what? Yes, to but, kill me? Yes. But, but Ken did, did, did not do it. Mm -hmm. Your Highness, Ken, Ken is innocent. Please. I just want us to search for him. He's innocent. Ken is an orphan. If he wanted the princess dead, he would have killed the princess, but he did not do it. Mr. Patrick is a bad man. He, he was the one that even sent people to, sh to, to shoot the princess, but instead they, they, they shot at the princess's friend. Unbelievable. Mm. What? Ken! 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 
to you. I greet you, my elders. I greet you, my queen. Sorry. I know I am not wanted here. But I must tell you this. Um, Mr. Williams has told us everything. Yes, I did. Mm. See, I, I suspected that Mr. Patrick was person behind all this so I, I came and I exposed him to everybody. Listen, I, I don't I don't I don't want the throne anymore. You did well. My queen. The princess is a good woman. She's not irresponsible. was only carried away, but I didn't, I didn't kiss her. I didn't. I know I am not wanted here. I know I am a nobody. But... Okay. Pure somebody. You are my husband to be. I love you, Ken. But... Do you love me? Um, Princess, he loves you. You see, he has said that to me some time ago. Sorry. I, I don't hate you. I don't. If not, I would have poisoned you like just as Mr. Patrick asked me to. Okay. Sir, you know, you and my nephew, Williams, have been very good friends for a long time. I'm yeah. thinking, it's about time we did something meaningful for him. I want us to help him. Okay, uh, but uh, how? Um, good. I want you to get a job at the palace and ensure that you land that job. I want you to be very close to the princess because you're going to be my idol. Okay, but... Uh, sir, if I get there, should I tell them you sent me? No, no, no. You're on your own when you get there. Until you get the job. Then I'll tell you why you're there. So, uh, did he give you any more details? No, he didn't. He only said I should get close to the princess. That's all. I think my uncle has a plan. Yeah, he sure does. And to think of it, they don't know we're friends. They don't. So I already got the job at the palace. I was um, employed as a palace guard and they asked me to come and start work tomorrow. Good. I knew you would get the job. Because there's a new princess. I want you to do me a favor. Oh sure, anything for you, sir, I'll do. Anything. I want you to do everything you can to get close to the princess. Close to the princess. Sir. Can I possibly be close to the princess? She is a woman, I'm a man. And I heard she had a lot of she has a lot of mates in the palace and how, how can that be possible? It's very impossible. She's just a small girl. That is why I want you to get close to her. Tune her. Pacify her. Praise her. Make her to like you. And if she does, the queen herself might make you happy. A personal guard, and if that happens, then from there we can execute our plans. 
plans? Sir, what plans are you talking about? I want you to kill the princess. Yeah, Ken, do you mean you are very close to her now? Did you put it for her? Yes. So that there will be no suspicion whatsoever. In less than seven days, she will be a dead person. Thank you very much. Yes, your friend will be very happy to hear this. He's getting ready with the girl. Yeah, go ahead. Thank you so much again. Once she's down, we will take over. <laughs> Bye. Yes. What? This is so, so unbelievable. He stabbed me in the bush. Someone helped me to survive. I knew it. Behind this. I'm sorry. Um, uh, he's, he's, he's bleeding. He's seriously wounded. Get the guards and you, you take him out there. The guards will help. Take him away. You're happy now. You're happy, right? You're doing this because I've been trying to help you. I've been trying to better your life. You're selling me over because of a friend. You betrayed me. My God will judge you. I hate you. Ah, move him! Move! Ah, hold this. So if nobody say now they find let her find these two guys now. We plan behind me go kidnap this girl. I forgot him, Jeff. Nah, uh, Robin, see, you suppose they praise God now. See, you suppose on Sunday you suppose go church, go give thanksgiving because waiting God do for you. I know the small thing. No, God no deal with me. Come give me a princess as a girlfriend. Nah, God do. You don't get you. princess as a girlfriend before. For we are, we are see girlfriend. But see, guy, you see that ghetto? Mm. Eh? From now on, that mm. ghetto. Oh, mommy, I know they did again. My school things, and I don't go back to school. If you no go back, guy, me, I don't go. Even though self, I no go to school, guy. Me, I don't go back to business. Huh? What's going on, young lady? What's, what's the meaning of this? I came to beg you. Please don't do this to my beg you. Listen, listen, I, I listen, listen. You. Just shut up and get out of my way. I do not want to have anything to do with you because you are evil and you're criminal. It's not true. Listen, don't touch me. If you touch me, I will give you a dirty slap. You know I was doing all that because of you. My friend, will you shut up if I slap your face? You're doing what because of me. Listen, let me clear that down. You're doing that because of your own selfish reasons. You did all that because you thought I was going to marry you. Stay out of my way or I will crush you. I am warning you. But that was the agreement now. Are you not supposed to be my king? What's not what you, you people promised me? Please, oh, please, I, I beg you, please, please, please don't do it now, please, please now, please. <laughs> my king, my king, my king.
from the bloodline of Nkweje dynasty, born of purity and royalty, beneficiary of the Eje clan, and granddaughter of her royal majesty, Queen Rebecca I. All hail her royal highness, Queen Muna, paramount ruler of Obimo kingdom. We shall all proceed outside for the final celebration. Stop.